Hey guys, so for this video, I want to do something a bit different. I want to talk about my braces. I noticed that there are not very many videos talking about having braces in college, and I thought I would fill that missing gap and talk about my own braces and my own experiences. I had these braces for around five and a half, six months. I got them a couple weeks before school started. And let's just say those first few days were pretty tough and I did feel really miserable about it. I knew that getting braces would be hard on my teeth and that they would be really, really sore after I got them placed on. And they were definitely sore. Eating, drinking, doing anything, even touching them, brushing them, it was really, really hard and tough. But I knew I had to get through it because once you get them on, the effort and money will be wasted if you remove them earlier than your treatment allows you to. So for my treatment, I have to wear braces for around two and a half years. I have a crossbite and I had issues with my baby tooth. I had my permanent tooth growing behind it. My baby tooth was still in there. During my time studying abroad in Japan, I thought my baby tooth would get looser, possibly fall out. I hoped that it wouldn't because I didn't want to get any procedures or any treatments done on my teeth while abroad. But luckily it stayed in there. And when I got back, I went to the dentist for a checkup and they had pointed me to an orthodontist to check out this baby tooth. And my orthodontist examined me and he told me that I had to cross bite. I had to get my baby tooth out. My wisdom teeth were also coming in at an angle so my teeth were getting cramped up. And overall he suggested that I get braces or I would have to undergo jaw surgery, possibly breaking my jaw. Once he said that, I started freaking out because I don't want to break my jaw ever. And he said that the reason why they would have to break my jaw is because I'm a bit older than children and teenagers who do get braces. And he said that if I wait any longer, I would have to break my jaw because my jaw at the moment is pretty soft, like it's still hardening. And there's still time for my teeth to move around and get lined up without having to go into such an extreme. I talked to my family about it parents and they all agreed that I should also do it just because they don't, don't want me to go through that and it's about time to get my teeth fixed and to remove that baby tooth. I was stressing out about it. The main thing I was stressing out about was the fact that I would start college with braces. Okay, even though I went to Japan and I've gained so much self-confidence and my self-esteem has risen so much and I'm just generally more confident and happy about myself, the braces totally stumped me and I was worried about my appearance and how people would take me because I'm a college student with braces. And I will admit, my first few days at college, it was pretty scary for me because I had braces and I hardly smiled because I didn't want to show them and I don't understand why. I look back now and I realize that it was nothing to freak out about or worry about. Like, I should be happy that I'm getting braces because I'm fixing my teeth, making them straighter. But it's understandable why I freaked out a bit. But I'm happy with my braces now. My next treatment, I go in to see the oral surgeon for a consultation in a few weeks because I have to remove my wisdom teeth. Right now, these past six months have just been working on removing my baby tooth, yay. And my permanent tooth has finally been brought forward right here. Oh, this tooth right here. This has a tooth. This tooth right there was pushed way back and when I had to remove that baby tooth, there was just a hole and it was really bothersome because I wanted my tooth to be pushed in. But luckily it got pushed in. It got pushed in pretty fast. I was really worried that it would take months to move into place but it looks pretty good. It hasn't fully been pushed out yet. Along with straightening my teeth and removing my baby tooth, my orthodontist has also been suggesting that I remove my wisdom teeth as soon as possible and which is why I'm going to the surgeon because my dentist cannot remove my teeth because they are in my jawbone. I cannot remove them without having surgery. My two wisdom teeth at the bottom, one of them's touching the nerve and I'm really nervous about that one. The other one is just, both of them are really bad. They're pushing my teeth out and my, my orthodontist and dentist have both said that once I remove my braces, if I don't get my wisdom teeth out, then my teeth are just gonna 
go back to how they were so it'd be a waste of treatment and at my next orthodontist appointment they're gonna get me fitted and ready for my palette expander yes i have to wear a palette expander to fix my cross by i've already have the rings and now they just have to put in my palette expander i believe he's gonna do that after i remove my wisdom teeth hopefully and i will film another video about the whole palette expander because i'm not looking forward to that my speech pattern might be different it probably will be different because they say that the palette expander messes with your speech and not really looking forward to it, but I want this treatment to go by. I'm happy that I have braces, and I don't think people should be worried about having braces when going to college. Yes, it's, I guess it'll be embarrassing for some people at first, but you meet other people who have braces, which is nice. I have another girl who has braces who lives in my dorm, and you know what? It's natural. It's fine, because once you remove your braces, you're gonna have amazing teeth. And it's all gonna be worth it because I look back at my old pictures and my old videos and I realized that my teeth weren't the best and I thought they were and I'm so glad to see the differences. If you're thinking about waiting until after college, I suggest you don't because I was gonna have it after I graduated. But I knew that if I waited that long that my treatment would possibly be longer. I might even have to have my jaw surgery. I didn't want to make life more harder than it already is and I think it's fine and it's also nice because I can't eat certain things anymore and it prevents me from picking out and stress eating sometimes when I feel overwhelmed with school stuff but overall I'm happy with them and I cannot wait to see how my teeth look like down the line and once they're removed I am totally celebrating and going out and eating all the things that I cannot eat right now and if you stay with me to the end I want to give you a big thank you pat on the back and you're awesome and I appreciate it and I will see you all later